Hi, welcome to this Visible Analyst how-to tutorial working with projects in the Visible Analyst Student Edition. The Student Edition of the Visible Analyst is limited to two active projects at a time, one of which is the Test Tutorial Project. If you delete the test project, you're limited to one active project at a time. Since you will need to create new projects to meet your assignments, this tutorial explains the procedures for switching between the active projects. We'll review the Backup, Restore, and Delete Project menu items here to switch between the projects. After you've created the maximum number of projects, when you try to create a new project, you'll see this error message. The maximum number of projects has already been created. At this point, you can choose to save a backup file set of this project for use in the future or you can delete the project from the Visible Analyst and create a new project. To create a backup of the project choose Tools, Backup. I have a backup folder already created but you can click the Browse button to select a different folder or you can click the icon to create a new folder where the backup file set will be created. Click OK and in this case I already have a backup file set of this project so this new backup will overwrite the existing backup file set. If you want to confirm that you will do this click Yes to overwrite the backup file set. The backup files are now written. At this point you can choose the Tools, Delete Project, you're prompted to confirm that you want to delete the project. Click OK. The project has been deleted. At this point, you have two options. You can create a new project by selecting New Project from the File menu, or you could choose to restore a project that you backed up previously. Select Restore from the Tools menu. You can click the first Browse button here and you can search for the backup file name of the project. It's always the name of the project, in this case CPR back.vsc. Backup files can be written to a flash drive or to a local folder on the PC or in a network environment to a network folder on the network. Click on the name of the backup file, click OK. The name of the project is listed in the project name field the target directory should not be changed. That's where the new project folder will be created and all the project files written to that folder. Click OK. Click OK again at the second restore dialog and the project has now been restored to the visible analyst. As you can see through the use of the backup, the delete project and the restore feature as well as the new project creation, you could switch between the active projects and the visible analyst. These items are further defined in the online help system included with every copy of the visible analyst. Thank you.